Hey there guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is John Campia and this is a special user submitted question video. Now where we got this question was, every day on the John Campia show, Monday through Friday, people send in questions, but on the rare occasion that somebody sends in a tip of like $50 or more, I like to honor that by not only answering the question on the show, but also answering it again later in its own standalone video. So that's what we're going to do right now. And this one gets sent in to us by LancePro85 who writes, Hey John, Please make a video titled, Why the Oscars are the Better Award Show. Well, I mean, I've talked about that so often, I don't really think probably a standalone video for that is necessary. Anyway, also, what do you think of the idea of the Oscars holding a separate competition on who will host the next Oscars that people can vote on? All right, thanks a lot for sending that in, man. And listen, as ridiculous as that might sound off the top of it all, do consider this. Our kind of TV culture right now is reality show competition obsessed. It's absolutely reality show competition obsessed. Everybody wants to make a drama on TV and then they vote and the winners go home or you know whatever the case may be is. Why not then, I can understand the concept, kind of take that and apply it to the Oscars and who's going to host the Oscars. Now, obviously, over the last couple of years, the Oscars have faced a real drama when it comes to who's going to be their host. It's not from lack of wanting a host or anything like that, but when they went through the situation a couple of years ago with Kevin Hart, where they selected Kevin Hart, there was a bunch of people excited about it, but sure enough, some people got really upset by it. Some old jokes of his from like eight years earlier ago got brought up that people didn't like and they caused this big problem. And ultimately, he stepped down from being the Oscar host. Now, they went without a host that year and it actually wasn't bad without, I thought it would be a disaster without a host, but it actually wasn't bad. Then they decided this year again to go without a host. Did not work as well. You're starting to feel now the lack of a host. It really did need a host this year. So the question becomes, what about the idea of holding a competition show and viewers vote and then the winner of that gets to host the Oscars? Well, while it sounds interesting in concept and I can understand why you'd ask, there are a couple of major, major problems with the idea. First of all, who hosts the Oscars should be up to the people who know the Oscars best, not to the home viewers at home. I honestly, I don't want, and maybe this sounds snobbish of me, but deal with it. I don't want some dude at home who maybe went to four movies this year and really doesn't know that much about movies, picking who's going to be the host of ceremonies of the biggest night of the movie year. I don't want that dude having a vote, to be honest with you. I just don't. But here's the bigger problem. No potentially credible good name for maybe hosting an Oscars is going to submit themselves to, you want me to be a part of a reality show where I can risk being humiliated and voted off and stuff like that? They're not going to do it. Do you think like, I'm just going to pull some names out here. Do you think like a George Clooney is going to go, oh yeah, I'll submit myself to an application process? No, nah, he's not going to do that. Do you think a Denzel Washington is going to go, you want me to be a part of a reality show where people can vote me off who don't even have anything to do with the Oscars in the movie business and risk kind of embarrassing myself? Why would they do that? There's just no way. So what you would end up with is a bunch of C and D list celebrities who have nothing else to get attention for them being willing to go on this reality show and then having people like me who are completely unqualified to select a host for the Oscars casting votes on whoever we thought won the competition that week. Like competition, don't drink water for 72 hours. Whoever doesn't die wins the competition that week and you get immunity. Like I... It just seems like we would end up with something disastrous. We would end up, I think, with something completely and utter disastrous. And so that's why I, even though in today's reality television competition obsessed culture, and there's some merit there, even despite that, I think it would ultimately be a real disaster. So no, I, I would personally not be down for it at all. It might make for a neat little freak show of a, of a short-term reality series, but then ultimately it wouldn't serve the Oscars. It wouldn't do justice for the Oscars. And ultimately getting the right host, which they don't always do, but getting the right host, the point of that is to serve the Oscars. And I just don't believe that's a system that serves the Oscars myself. Anyway, guys, I don't know. What do you think? Maybe you think this could be something fresh, something different to try. Jump down to the comment section below and let me know what you think. All right, guys, that'll do it for me for this video. Thanks a lot for being here. My name is John Campia. And until next time. Bye-bye.